Neil, with the top six spot secured, I suppose there's there's so many permutations and things to think about this weekend, isn't there? Whether it's you know players that have been carrying knocks, needing a bit of a refresh, players who need minutes, momentum for the playoffs, all those things that are probably going on in your head. Yeah, there's a, there is a lot to put into the the pot. Um, thinking wise for this game on Sunday, um, obviously Tuesday it was great to get the job done. You know, mathematically we're definitely in the playoffs. Um, but the yeah, there's a lot of permutations, but we just have to look at our focuses on Bristol and trying to win that game. Um, however, I, I'd also be lying that if I said there wasn't going to be some changes because. I think you've got to, we've got to get the balance right between the ones who have played a lot of minutes and for the last you know a few weeks months we've been playing Saturday Tuesday pretty much every week um, so it might be a chance to give one or two a breather one or two a chance who have not been playing to get some games uh, game time because in ten days after that game when we're playing in the semi final we'll have some tough decisions to make and you know in certain certain positions, who we're going to play or what formation we play because we played different formations recently. So there's a lot to think about, um, but, you know, 12 o'clock Sunday, um, we want to we want to carry on with the winning run that we're on. We won three games on the bounce without conceding. We want to make it four. We've had a good home record this season. We want that to continue. Um, yeah, like you said, momentum and confidence. Um, is important and we want that to carry on into the, the two semi-final games. You mentioned that there could be some changes, is, is there any position where you've got players that could come back into the squad or do you still need to give them a little bit more time? Um, no, I think the squad will be very similar to what it was on um, Tuesday, um, so the injured players that we've got at the moment won't be ready for this game um, and it's again it's an unnecessary risk you don't need to take at this moment in time. So as we don't play to the following Tuesday or Wednesday, that's another 10 day break uh, where we can hopefully get some training into those players before uh, before being involved in them games. So Tuesday, uh, Sunday's game, the, the squad will be very similar to what it was on uh, Tuesday night. Um, it's just that obviously uh, there might be some changes and changes of formation going into this game.